In the serene town of Evergreen, nestled among lush landscapes and quiet neighborhoods, a community gathered to mourn the passing of Isabella, the cherished wife of Thomas. Funeral preparations had been meticulous thanks to the efforts of Thomas's father-in-law, who spared no detail to honor Isabella's memory. As mourners solemnly arrived from nearby streets, a veil of sadness draped over them as they entered Thomas's home, creating an atmosphere laden with grief. The air carried the scent of delicate flowers, a poignant reminder of the occasion. The day took an unexpected turn as evening descended, casting a warm glow over the town. An unforeseen power outage abruptly plunged the house into darkness. In a town accustomed to tranquil evenings, the sudden loss of electricity heightened the somber atmosphere that already permeated the air. Perplexed and frustrated, Thomas, the grieving husband, stepped onto the porch, his eyes scanning the houses adorned with lights, each a beacon of normalcy except for his own. A sense of unease settled over him as he turned on the flashlight on his phone and descended the stairs toward the seldom used storage room. The door to the storage room creaked open, revealing a space cluttered with forgotten belongings. Thomas fumbled for a flashlight and began investigating, unsure of what to expect. The room felt frozen in time, a repository of memories and relics. As Thomas explored the storage room, a strange feeling nagged at him, as if an unseen presence lurked in the shadows. Fearful, he decided to lock the room and head back upstairs. Climbing the stairs, he halted mid-step, sensing an invisible force ascending behind him. Each footstep seemed to echo an elusive entity. When he stopped, the sound persisted, echoing up and down the stairs, tantalizingly close yet invisible. The funeral continued, and the guests departed for their homes after expressing condolences. However, Thomas remained restless, haunted by the peculiar occurrences of the night. As he lay in bed, unable to find solace in sleep, a sound emanated from his son's room. Startled, Thomas rushed to the room and switched on the light. His son lay peacefully asleep, oblivious to the events unfolding around him. The strange occurrences persisted. A toy car moved, seemingly propelled by an unseen force. Thomas placed the toy on the dining table, but the unnerving incidents were far from over. As Thomas sipped water in the hall, a voice echoed behind him. Whirling around, he found an empty space. Puzzled and disturbed, he retreated to his room, attempting to find rest. However, a persistent sound of footsteps on the roof interrupted his peace. Every time he closed his eyes, the sound resumed, only to stop when he opened them again. The incidents that began on the night of his wife's funeral seemed to follow him, inexplicably intertwined with the grief that enveloped the quiet town of Evergreen. <laughs> 